here's how you get the great circle. Okay. You take the two points and you take a knife. Let's pretend this is a spherical orange. Okay. And you take a knife and you cut through both points, your origin and your destination. Okay. And as you cut through the orange in a straight path, okay. that cut must go through the center of the orange and come out the other side. So now if you... that cut goes through the center of the orange, then those two points are on a great circle. If you cut this way, right, then... you're gonna you're gonna shear you're off gonna the top shear off of the, the top, orange, and you would not have gone through you the center of the orange. There. So what you have to do is angle. Here's point one. Here's point two. Mm -hmm. You angle your knife so angle that the blade. The angle the blade yes. of the knife. Yes. So that when you cut, although you're coming towards this point, the blade itself is actually angled so it passes through the very center of the orange. Correct. No matter where no matter you're going. where you are. Correct. Correct. Yeah. Because then what you're going to end up, no matter where you start it, is two halves of an orange yes. with two circles as ah. the face of the orange. And they're the great circles, that's, the biggest circles you can cut on Earth. That's pretty wild. It's wild.